Yeah, for sure. Obviously, tonight's a, it was a huge game for us, and, and we're focused on it. We know we need to win, and we need to uh, we need to go out there and earn it tonight. How do you avoid what's happened maybe the last two games in terms of you know, getting leads and then surrendering them? And how do you avoid that trap for you, I guess? Um, it's just about the way we play. Obviously, you know we gotta we gotta let those games go and uh, just focus on tonight and and getting the win. We don't uh, you know we can't think about what's happened in the past. We just gotta keep uh, you know playing our playing our game and get back to uh, playing the way we want to. I know there have been the leads, but how much emphasis is on that first goal against a team that you know can score on the other side? Uh, the first goal is big, but it's uh, the biggest thing is staying with it. I think no matter what happens, um, we want to stick with it. We get the first goal, or they get the first goal. It's it's about sticking with it um, and not getting you know too up or too down when we, when that happens. So I think that's our that's our main focus. When uh, you were sort of banged up a little bit with the way this this team is back on the blue line with only five D, does that sort of maybe not rush it a little bit, but sort of make you need to get back in there? No, obviously you want to play. You know, in the situation where where we need guys to line up, it's a it's a time of the year where you want to play. Um, you know, it's not it's not rush, but it's it's a, you know obviously everybody wants to play. So if, if the opportunity is there and you feel good enough, you know you're going to be playing. Are you one of those guys who watches the scoreboard, or do you sort of try to stay away from it? I try to stay away from it. I think it just, uh, I like to focus on our games, and the good thing is we can control what happens. So, you know, if we play well and we get the wins, we're, we're in a good spot. That being said, as far as controlling your destiny and playing well as a team, what's the conversation like going into big games like tonight? Um, obviously, we want to be relaxed. We don't want to be, uh, you know, we don't want to be too... Uh, uh, jittery out there or anything we just want to you know we know what's at stake but we just got to play our game we got to be ready to go we got to be uh, you know right from the start to the end we got to play a good game tonight. For the last several seasons it's been exciting when the Penguins and the Islanders play it seems like there's a little extra chippiness out there some aggressive play how would you describe what it's been like playing them especially this year? Uh, it's been fun they're a fun team to play they play hard and you know what to expect I think uh, you know they play fast-paced game with a lot of energy and, and uh, you know we, we play the same way so we want to bring uh, you know, the same effort tonight and I think it'll be a fun game to watch. Uh, yeah, obviously we, you know, we want to start the same way we did. Um, obviously we don't want to cheat. It's not like, uh, you know, we're selling the farm to, to get the goal right away. We just want to, we want to stick with the game plan. And I think, uh, you know, our game plan's in place for a reason. And, and if we stick to it, we'll be fine.